Adam Pohl here with uh, head coach Graham Miller and uh, coach Miller 3-2 defeat to Catholic today. You guys fell behind early and I thought you you just used so much effort to get back into the game and I think you've got to be really proud of your your team with with uh, how they pushed forward especially in the late portion of the game. Yeah, I mean we can't fault the effort in the last and in the second half to be honest, you know. Um, you know, we were outdone by a very poor 45 minutes, um, you know, very flat 45 minutes um, to start the first half. Um, I thought second half, uh, you know, the effort was there all the way to the end. And, you know, we made a game of it at the end, you know. And the third goal for them, you know, we, you know, you have to go forward, push numbers. I can't fault the guys for that. I didn't fault them for that. Uh, but the first two goals are definitely uh, easy for us to defend. And we keep giving up these soft goals. So, I mean, the lesson for the guys today is when we're going to play against these really good teams like Catholic, you can't play for 45 minutes. You have to play for the full 90 minutes. And like you said, we used a lot of effort up by doing nothing in the first half. And then it took us a little bit. And the guys really, I mean, I, I give them credit. They really worked hard to the end. Jay Smith, of course, scores two goals in this game, one of which was on an outstanding play, curling around a defender and being taken down in the box, scoring on a penalty. And then the other one was really a play where he used his toughness and strength. I really think on both those goals, you saw the strength of him as far as being able to stay on the ball and just being hard to take off of it. Yeah, and that's what we've been telling Jay. We've been telling Jay, hey, look, don't worry about the defender. Don't worry about the keeper. You're a big, strong boy. That's what yeah. we've been saying to him. Just hold on to the ball, go to the ball, run with the ball. They're going to have to bounce off you he had a tendency the first few games where um he's kind of like looking at the defender rather than himself and and he needs to be the you know he needs to take care of himself first and then the defenders will worry about him and you've seen that when he went back actually all day today he had a chance in the first half where he hit it over the bar because he pressed um so he you know he had he got the goals today that he didn't get on saturday and he just needs to keep worrying about himself and not worrying about the defense because he is big and strong and he can score you've seen that Lastly, you talk about the better second half than the first. You guys got six corner kicks in the game. They were all in the second half. And that's been one of the main assets of your game, the ability to win high balls and score with headers and things of that nature. You were unable to get a goal like that today, and that may have been costly. Yeah, I mean, the, uh, we created enough. You know, that's we, we created so many chances, and it's, you know, nine shots in the second half. And, you know, if we'd only did that in the first half. And the corners were good, but um, we weren't attacking the ball. We had a couple of nice headers, but we got to mix it up. Maybe we, we've got some other, um, you know, what I would say corners in our repertoire that we need to use, short corners, mix it up, because they had some height, and those guys won a lot of balls in the air, and we just, you know, we, we couldn't get one in on that. Well, Coach Miller, uh, you know, good luck here going forward, especially with these uh, two back-to-back -back games this weekend. Yeah, we're looking forward to it. Thank you.